the end in the 53, but a good time for you, 28.6 for you, please, for that one? Yeah, pretty much. Um, I got, um, I injured my hip after London and I've had a lot of infections in me. So, I mean, to come away on that time, I think that's the second fastest this year, uh, the fastest time I did in London uh, earlier, so last month. So, yeah, it's great, you know. Obviously, you're world and European champion in that 53. How much does your focus now? go just solely on that 53 because you do have other events as well. Yeah I've got other events but mainly that's what I want. Um, I've won basically over the past three years now I've won gold in the 50s at the European and at World Championships so we want to round it off nicely and we'll see. Your, your 28.33 from last season led last year's world rankings. Have you set yourself a target in terms of time 28 low again this season? I don't set myself targets only I'm doing this winning and that was my aim today. My aim today was to win the race. Uh, but I've got some uh, big S10 lads next to me, you know, it's quite tough. But, you know, I love, I love racing, you know. I've got these new got Speedo goals, new heart, I've got the new shots on that, you know. It seems to be working. Um, so, September. Fingers crossed. How much are you really looking forward to getting a hard block of training in now and to build up to the games? Oh, I never look forward to hard, but hard training, but you've got to do it. If you don't do the training, you don't get the rise at the end. Well, that's it. All right, cheers.